dancing can wait, that you make sale the congestion top priority, that you city, that you, Philippine tourists may again look forward to taking visits in Cebu and be treated to a performance by the province's popular dancing inmates. Cebu Governor Gwendolyn Garcia has promised to bring back this attraction when the provincial government addresses all problems plaguing the Cebu Provincial Detention and Rehabilitation Center. Her overcrowded Garcia, during her first visit to Cebu since she returned as Cebu Governor, faced the problem of congestion at the provincial jail facility, which is designed to hold 1,600 inmates. The provincial jail currently has 2,525 inmates. She said she needed to address the welfare of inmates by improving the building, reviewing security concerns and solving congestion before allowing the dancing inmates to perform in public again. Throughout the centers, the governor said she would pass longer crews to help expedite the inmates' cases. She also wanted to hasten the process of plea bargaining for drug offenders, which comprise more than 80% of prisoners at first. I think we have to start first with the basics. That left square graphic dance performances right square graphic will have less priority right now. We must first focus on decongestion, upgrading the infrastructure, and most importantly, security. For nine years as governor, we left square graphic conducted right square graphic greyhound operations left square graphic prison, race right square graphic, Wallace with Makita Nation we left square graphic but we did not find Shabu, Crystal Neck, right square graphic, Garcia said. She said the entry of contraband items at the provincial jail was a major concern. To address this, she said the security system should be reviewed and changed. Garcia said she has tasked the province's general services office to inspect the jail and fix structures or features that needed repairs. Even the inmates' uniforms have problems, she said. Most of them, she said, wear shirts of different shades of orange because the previous administration had not allotted any budget for buying new sets of uniforms. Sensation in 2006 her inmates became YouTube sensations after their dance performance of Michael Jackson hit, Life Thriller and They Don't Care About Us, went viral. The performance attracted serious tourists, who were then treated to weekly performances at Kirk. The performances gradually stopped after Garcia stepped down in 2013. Performance last week, the inmates got a chance to perform again during Garcia's visit. The governor said she appreciated the inmates' performance because they asserted effort in learning the choreography through the guidance of a fellow inmate, a former choreographer. Garcia promised that when problems in the provincial jail were addressed, the inmates could again practice their dance moves and perform. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.